Hey guys, Bob Morielli here with The Tuning School, and today we're going to talk to you about pre-ignition and spark plugs. Okay, so we get a lot of tech support requests here at The Tuning School, and one of the most common tech support requests we get, we're helping people diagnose and figure out why they're having detonation problems. They're seeing knock all over the place. Usually it's happening with forced induction cars. And so when we start going through the tuning process and we look at the air fuel, we make some changes. We look at the spark advance, we make some changes, and we don't see any real improvement in the detonation issues. We then start to look at physical problems. And so invariably the next question is always, what kind of spark plugs are you running? And so they'll say, well, well, we're smart. We went one heat range colder or two ranges colder, whatever they thought was right. But I'll say, no, what spark plugs are you running? And they'll always say, ah, oh, no, we got the best. We got iridium or we got platinum or whatever, unobtainium, I don't know, take your pick. The problem is they went to the parts store and they picked the most expensive plugs they could find because the parts store guy probably said they were the best plugs and that these copper plugs are out of date and you don't want these things. So uh, what they've created is their own problem. Inadvertently, they don't know it, they've already created their own detonation problem. Platinum and iridium plugs are very poor conductors of heat. So trying to get that heat out of the tip of the plug and all the way back out does not happen very well with those metals. The reason they use those metals uh, from an OE standpoint is durability. They can go 50, 100,000, 120,000 miles without changing the spark plugs, as opposed to the older copper plugs, which did require changing more often. So once we realize the customer has done this, we advise them to go ahead and get some better plugs with either copper or silver, because those are much better conductors of heat. And so we're going to look for just a minute at this chart provided by our friends over at Brisk Spark Plugs. And in this chart, you'll be able to see the conductivity and how bad platinum and iridium really are. You see they're very low on the chart compared to a standard copper or even one of Brisk's plugs, which are silver. So if you uh, go ahead and, and pick the right plug for your application, it's going to be either copper or silver or something that has a very high heat conductivity rate so that you have already stacked the odds in your favor so that you don't have to worry about creating your own problem because it does not matter how long you, sp you spend behind the screen of your laptop, you will never tune around a physical problem like having the wrong spark plugs in the combustion chambers.